24 7 tv in 1896 american taxidermist carl lakely was attacked by a leopard while on a visit to africa and killed it with his bare hands by ramming his hand down the leopard's throat and choking it to death i always thought that would be a viable survival tactic but i'm glad somebody else proved it for me if you try to pull away they just bite down harder and their teeth are sharp and will tear you apart before they let go of you but they won't be expecting you to ram your first down their throat how do you get your hand in its mouth after it's already bitten your leg or something and latched on they'll hold on for ages and not let go honestly nose punches it is a soft wet organ that they have tons of nerves in when i was a young kid like 10 or so eyes old i feared large dogs like german shepherds and such my dad told me if one charges to make a fist with my right hand and shove it down their throat then wrap my left arm around its neck so it can't get away then just keep pushing my fist into its throat i've always remembered this and thought no way that'll work a leopard's bite force in pounds per square inch is between 300 and 310 psi on average its bite force quotient, which is an animal's bite strength measured in Newton's metric unit for weight divided by the animal's body weight, is 97, which is lower than that of a lion or an average domestic dog. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, subscribe my channel. It's Mike from 247 TV.